Hey guys, my name is Allison and welcome back to my channel. Today I want to talk about um, disinfecting your tools. So specifically ones that are kind of hard to disinfect like your brushes, um, your combs, and cleaning out your dilution bottles. So I actually a lot of people use bleach, diluted bleach, and that kind of scares me. Um, I just, I don't know. I know it's safe because it's diluted and everything, but it just, like, I really just don't like the idea of it. Um, so I use apple cider vinegar, um, the organic, raw, unfiltered apple cider vinegar. Shake it up. I've got it in a spray bottle so I can spray down my brushes and equipment. So I'm literally going to put my brushes down, their hairs out of them, and just spray them down. With the apple cider vinegar. This one has a little bit of hair in it. I think it's really important to um, not only disinfect like and clean your blades and your scissors, but a lot of times we don't think about our brushes and stuff that honestly touches the skin directly, um, our combs and all that stuff. I have brushes that I use just for my own dogs and then ones I use for clients because of that reason. So you know why would I not disinfect? my brushes that have to be used on all my clients. So pretty much, I just kind of bang them out. And then those will sit and dry. And that's it. And I'm gonna spray my combs down. It's a really safe way, in my opinion, to just try and disinfect your stuff and keep it all clean. Something that's really important that um, we really need to shed some light on, I know it's been talked about a little bit on Facebook, but disinfecting your dilution bottles. Um, not leaving shampoo. Diluted shampoo does not need to be in a dilution bottle any longer than 24 hours. I make sure mine's not in there for 12 hours. That scares me. Um, because it starts to grow bacteria while it's sitting there. So we really need to make sure we're taking care of your dilution bottles. I get notorious like I, I don't clean them every night or, or um, disinfect them every night, but I don't let mixed shampoo sit in a dilution bottle overnight. That's a no-no. So I just poured a little bit of the apple cider vinegar directly in here. Put the lid on it, make sure it's all shut, give it a couple shakes, and I'm going to let that sit, and I'm going to kind of let it sit on its side so it kind of gets all in there. And I'm going to do the same to all of my dilution bottles that I have. Just put just a little bit in there, doesn't take much, shake it all up. Dog skin are so sensitive and like I can't I can't get on the bleach train I'm not someone who believes in all organic things um, I don't use organic shampoo um, you know but this is one thing I do believe in disinfecting um, with apple cider vinegar organic raw apple cider vinegar um, Braggs has the best brand, but I think that's backwards. Whoops. And that's pretty much it. I'll pour this out and we'll be done. All right, then you just leave all your stuff to dry overnight. 
um, rinse out the bottles, all that good stuff, and then you're done. And you, they're good to use for the morning. Uh, make sure you subscribe, follow me on Instagram, all that good stuff. And I will always make sure I post on Instagram when new videos are going live. So, thank you. We'll chat next time. Bye.